the bones series we start with pork back rib don't forget to subscribe for this dinner get the meaty pork baby back rib make sure it's long enough to make a cylinder because we're making cooking sculptural art We have to take the baby back rib out of the plastic bag, of course. Make sure you buy the one with the bone in it still. There you are, out of the plastic wrap. Wash it clean first. Now we're going to make a cylinder out of it. Tie it around with a small wire. I know, it's not an easy job to do it. But we've got to try and try. There you are, we did it. It's a nice cylinder shape for a baby back rib, huh? Get the soul food seasoning and spread it on the top. Get the ground cinnamon Spread it on the top. Get the ground cloves. Spread it a little bit on the top. Get the ground nutmeg. Spread it a little bit on the top. Get the ground ginger. Spread it on the top. Now wrap them all over. Don't forget to put salt in it. Now turn it upside down and do the same thing. Put all the same spices like before. And do the side the same thing too. Don't forget to rub it all over. Push two sticks to secure it. Just to make sure the cylinder will be intact. Now cover it with foil paper all around on the top so it won't get burned. Then put it in the oven. Bake it for one and a half hour. Now let's get the jambalaya package. Cook it according to the direction on the package. Now 
There, it's cooked now. Stir the rice a little bit. Take out the foil paper. Look, how nice it turns out. Now, let's get the daikon radish. Peel it first. Daikon radish is mainly from Japan. It can be eaten raw or cooked. They are so delicious. I use daikon radish as a side dish. Also for decoration in the plating. After washing it, we're going to boil it. Let it boil for five minutes. And take it out and put it on the plate. Cut each half into four. Now cut the other half into four too. There, I got eight pieces of them. Okay, it's time for plating. Cut the sticking out sticks. Don't forget to take out the wire. I got some red radish the other day. Wash them up and put them in a container. Arrange the jambalaya rice around the baby back rib. Now, put the red radish on the top.
I try to arrange the white radish particularly. But I didn't like it because it keeps falling down. So I cut it up in small pieces. And I arrange it around the rice. And put the red radish in between. Sometimes you just have to improvise when things don't work as you plan. They look so festive already, huh? How pretty for the holiday dinner. Bon appetit! Happy holiday!